Welcome back to Farm and Culture. This is Claudia and today we're going to be showing you how to make beet pickled eggs. Um, this recipe is one of my favorites because it only requires five ingredients. There are not many things you can make today in the kitchen that only are only five ingredients and have this much flavor. So let's get started. Um, first thing you want to do is add one third cup of sugar into your mason jar that you're going to be pickling in. And then um, we're going to add three quarter cup of hot water. You can just heat it up on the stove. I have an Insta Hot here, which makes these little tasks a little easier. So we're gonna put that right on top of the sugar so we can dissolve it. And this is one of the easiest ways to make a, a brine. So the sugar goes on top. While that's kind of melting, we're gonna add some allspice. It's one teaspoon of allspice, the whole spices, and then also one teaspoon of whole cloves. Add that as well. It smells yummy already. Um, the next thing we're gonna do is we're going to finish off the brine with three quarter cup of apple cider vinegar. I like to use organic, of course, with the, the mother, but use whichever one is on sale because once you add in all of these different spices, you're not, you're not gonna really taste the purity of the, the vinegar. So anyway, we add in the apple cider vinegar, just like that, put the lid on, and just make sure the brine is fully mixed and the sugar is dissolved. I used to make these all the time at Farm and Culture in the shop and we would use these to, uh, to make pickled eggs and deviled eggs and different little snacks that are packed full of protein. So once the brine is done, you wanna go ahead and just add some raw beets. These are all sliced momentarily. You can make them, you can slice them larger or small, whatever you wanna do. And then we're gonna add eight hard boiled eggs that are already peeled and ready to go. And you can layer the beets in there too, so it's kind of mixed in. Now once these sit for 24 hours, the color is gonna be gorgeous. You'll, the color will be as purple as these beets. So we're gonna go ahead and put those in. And you can shred these beets. You can um, definitely slice them as I did. I kind of like the slices. I think it looks pretty. Secure the lid on. And I leave these out for 24 hours room temperature. And you will see them completely change and turn totally purple. And they make beautiful little snacks. So that's it. It doesn't get much simpler than that. Um, leave a comment below and let me know what you guys think. And um, I would also suggest that you watch the video on beet deviled eggs because they are delicious and this is the main ingredient. So once you have these all made and ready to go, you can make your um, beet deviled eggs and share them with all of your friends and family. So there you have it. Thanks guys. Mm -hmm.